guys. Welcome back to my channel. So, ooh, I don't know who this man is, but let's talk about it, right? So, LaMike Jr., he's apparently a YouTuber. Um, Y'all know these YouTubers doing this thing called a 20 versus 1, where they invite a male or a female, and they invite 20 people to come on. And normally that person will rate the 20 people, whether they like them or not. And, you know, it's a competition type of thing where they, you know, pick one person, they go on a date, whatever, whatever, whatever. All right. This dude apparently invited the baby to this 20 versus 1, and he said the baby is trying to scam him out of 20K. Now, here's the Mike Jr. story. Check this out. I paid the baby $20,000, and he walked all set, bro. He walked all set, bro. I'm going to be real, bro. Like, I'm defeated, bro. Like, I don't know how long I could do this shit, bro. My grandma gave me $10,000 out of the 20000 bro. Because she wanted to see this video before she go, bro. She battling cancer right now, bro. Like, and I did this shit for her, bro. My great-grandma, bro. Like, I'm at a loss for words, bro. Can y'all please tag the baby and tell him, please run this video back, bro. Please run a video back, bro. I put my all into this YouTube, bro. I'm 19, bro. I'm from New Orleans, Louisiana, bro. A lot of people don't make it to this position, bro. Please. Bro. I just deleted, bro. Just deleted. Just deleted. Yeah. So, according to LaMike Jr., he said that his grandmother, who is now deceased, gave him 10K of the 20K he needed to get the baby to come on his YouTube channel. Now, a lot of comments said that this was flaw and that he's lying because why would you let your, your, your dead grandmother like that, okay? So, the baby came out and basically said that he was disrespected by LaMike's team, his homeboy, and that he went for the stake he didn't get disrespected, so he left. Now, this is the baby side of the story. Check this out. Yes, sir. The young nigga want to know the idea. Go to the idea, young nigga. Because I'm feeling good tonight. I'm on some other shit. See what I'm saying? I was on some other shit the other night, too. That's why I just, I just left peacefully. I said, hmm, this is preposterous. I'm out of here. But since, you know, you getting on here and you you making your little story up and all that and, and now you you got you got people playing with my name. Like I just came and just robbed you. Check this, this what we gonna do. I'ma take the twenty thousand dollars that you gave me for my time for that hour plus that I spent it up. And I'ma give a thousand dollars a piece to them twenty girls that you paid to let a lame nigga like you disrespect them. You know what I'm saying? For that little YouTube check. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get that 20000 that you gave me. I'm going to give it to them girls, them queens. You know what I'm saying? Because they don't need to be having no lame-ass nigga like you. Play with them, know it. But you? Boy, you're through. You're over with. It's done. That's day money. That's them queens money, nigga. Yo, it ain't 20 verse me no more. It's 20 verse you, nigga. It, it, you're through. And I'm telling you, too, I, w I was just talking to my partner, Rico, when I left from that motherfucker the other night. We we sat outside the hotel, talked for a little minute. Like, I ain't got no business even, you see what I'm saying? It's easy as that, that quick little, that quick little 20 ball is to pick up. I ain't got no business. Look, look at the type of little nigga I was just in there dealing with. This little nigga, you, you're lying on your grandma. You're playing. You 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 sick. You a sick little dude. You a sick little dude. Like I said, the way people believe in that little story you made up, I can only imagine. People probably be believing this twenty verse one shit like this shit for real. Like you don't be paying these girls to do this. So so this this we gonna do. Now, to be frank, I mean, the baby doing the 20 versus 1 is ghetto. Because, again, he's a rapper. Like, why he doing shit like that? On top of that, um, I think it's degrading to do them um, 20 versus 1s and those um, balloon popping social experiments. Like, it's all degrading as hell. Because people walking in, based off your attractiveness, before you open your damn mouth, and half the time, these women, because especially black women half the time, be making themselves look stupid. So, I hate that. But, as he said... 
You didn't expect him, partner. So he wasn't playing that. And thank God the baby did what he did and gave them girls a thousand dollar piece and said, F you. Now you down 20 bands. Oh, well. Stop playing with him. Like, he been canceled too many times now, so I'm pretty sure you know how to move better. So, yeah, he did the right thing. So, Bala Mike Jr., that YouTube channel is going to be the flunks. Get out your ass, get. And that's on period. Okay, let me know if you're in the comments. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Peace. Yuck.